it is four in the morning ready to go do a shop this morning and it's only like an eight nine dollar delivery but i never take for granted the size of the delivery or anything like that i just do it because sometimes i know there are people who do shops and sometimes they wait till like the shop is like twenty dollars or something like that some crazy like that but i'm like i have in my experience it's been like i'll do like a seven eight dollar shop or an eight nine dollar shop and i'll end up with like a 15 20 dollar tip so um i never ever you know ignore like the smaller orders and stuff like that um because you never know what you're gonna get sometimes i get tipped sometimes i don't and um that's just how the attitude i have about it so some people would think i'm crazy because they're like i would never do a shop for seven eight dollars but i mean that's seven eight more dollars that you never had so yeah i'm gonna go do my i'm gonna go make my money so let's go heck yeah i gotta get one of those for my son let me make sure I lock my doors because this is potentially a very dangerous place around here. So, so many people who are disabled or they have a, you know, type of social um, anxiety or disorder that makes it incapable for them to be around people. So, you know, I take those orders, you know, I mean, but like I said, money is money, you know, um, but at the same time. You know, you're helping people who really do need help. And then, um, you know, you have people who have very busy lives who can't, you know, shop for themselves. So they rely on somebody else to help them. So I always try to think in terms of being oh, an assistant. How was the game last night? It was great. I won the 50-50. No way. Congratulations. Yeah, they cut your girl a check. <laughs> so now I'm going through my Facebook page and unfriending everybody I owe money. Yeah, I changed my name. I got changed my number. Got a new social security number. Yeah, it's going down. Um, I can understand you unfriending everybody on Facebook because you owe them money. But why are you unfriending mom? Oh, the same reason why I'm unfriending you. Uh-huh. Celeste, you can't unfriend me with sisters. I'm sorry, have we met? Nah. It's just an abdicator book, and I was like, oh my god. I was like, I gotta have that book. I gotta get two of them, one for my son and then one for my grandson. I have to have it. And then I saw the price, I was like, $15? Really, bro? There better be a unicorn. Then I was like, if I buy that at the arena, it's going to be double that. Oh, so yeah, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. This bump to the universe. Some people say, oh, there is a unicorn at the end. He makes his first goal. Well, that's great. But does a unicorn like jump out of the gold net? That's, that's what I want. That's what I want to see. It's a children's book. It's got to have magic. Ain't no magic in an autobiography. Oh, magic in this world. Hey, when you wake up in the morning, hey, my arms are